just tie it up like that, would you? Be happy to, Pastor Thanks. Danny. You know, we've been talking about favor, and favor is, is curried, is procured through excellence. And we find that, that if you need favor in your life, the best way you can do that is, is to improve the things that you're doing now, to become even more pursuant to the Word of God. You know, the Bible says that, that we are to seek Him diligently. Proverbs 10, 4 says that He becometh poor that deals with the slack hand, but the hand of the diligent maketh rich. And yes. I don't mean just rich in cash flow. I mean rich in the things of God that really matter. And the whole thing that, that all this amounts to is we are to perpetuate the covenant of God on the earth. We're to tell people about why they don't have to be sick in their body, why they don't have to have somebody beating them, why they don't have to have some sadness. And it's not to say that, that ill doesn't befall people, but it is to say you don't have to remain in that situation. We find that, that Joseph procured favor when he produced excellence as he was in the prison. And as a result of being in the prison, even though the baker and the butler forgot about him, yeah. because he was excellent, he was given favor of the jailer over all of the jail. Now, even though the butler and the baker didn't really go through with it, he gets, to, he gets into the kingdom, and notice that he gets to the kingdom, and Potiphar's wife throws him out. He gets back into the kingdom. Pharaoh makes him number two over the land, and there's seven years of feast and seven years of famine. We don't find out about Joseph being having all the toys and all the accoutrements, what we find out is Joseph had favor so that he could be positioned to succeed and to help God's children get the outcome that God has for them. That's the reason that favor is available to us, Pastor Danny. And I, I want to share with these folks that they have control. You bet. One of the things I like about the kingdom of God is God gives us that choice. And in that choice, we have the opportunity to either pursue Him or to pursue away from him. And we've talked about pursuing peace, that it's an it's a active, not a reactive. It's a pursuing is an active step. Joseph's favor was, was brought upon him because God had a plan for him, and he has a plan for your life. He had a plan for Daniel, for Shadrach, Meshach, and Abednego, and those people had favor because of the excellence that they demonstrated. Why did they have excellence, Danny? Because they spent time alone with the King of Kings and the Lord of Lords. When there was a dream to be interpreted, God put that into their heart. Maybe you're facing a conundrum that you don't know how to solve. Maybe you've been unemployed and you have no idea what to do. Pastor Danny mentioned earlier in this show or a previous show about praying in tongues. Sit down and listen to the voice of the Holy Ghost. One minute. Listen to the voice of the Holy Spirit. He will tell you what to do and it may or may not make sense to your natural mind. You know, one of the biggest opponents of faith is reason. Mm -hmm. And I'm not, Absolutely. I'm not saying you should be unreasonable, but you know when you know when God tells you to do something, and it could be as simple as picking up a candy wrapper in a parking lot as, right. as you make your way to the trash can. God's looking for people that will obey. Jacob was willing to obey. Joseph was willing to obey. Shadrach, Meshach, and Abednego were willing to obey. And when I say obedience, I don't mean you got to stop having fun. I'm saying you'll have more fun. Danny, you and I share a penchant for watches. Yeah. As much as I'd like to buy a Blanc Pont, yeah. Aqua Le Mans, yeah. Grande, I'll get about 30 days worth of pure joy out of that. And then after that, I'll probably won't enjoy it as much as if I take those same funds and I pursue God with all faith and virtue. Pastor Danny, back to you.